Hi everyone, thank you so much for watching. My name is Yadira. Today I wanted to do a quick wrap up a review on all of my skincare tools. I know the holidays are here and some of these items might be on your personal Christmas wish list or you are looking to give someone during this holiday season. I have eight skincare tools here to share with you. I'm gonna start off with the very first one by the brand New Face. New Face is a brand that has a variety of different products and that are FDA cleared to give you spa-like results at home using their microcurrent technology on their devices. So these devices are targeted for people who are looking to either tone, lift, or tighten a specific portion of their either face or body. The very first one that I wanted to talk about, it is their line smoothing device. This is, this retails for $115 and it is likely to be comboed with the serum. So she has both of these I think for $159 on the website and then you can buy it at Sephora, Nordstrom, or Ulta. You can use this for travel because it is compact and it does come with the lid. All the other ones do not. You can use this for your lips to enhance or plump your lip line or to erase any of your smile lines that form here. Or if you have like the 11s here in the forehead area, you can smooth those out. Also for the ends of your eyes for any crepiness or crow's feet that may be there. These devices do have instant results, but they're not long lasting. They're very much temporary, but it's still a very nice way to do a five minute treatment on your face just to kind of pamper yourself and feel good about yourself. But like I said, it is instant and I actually don't have anything on my lips because I did want to demonstrate at least one of the products that I was going to share. In case you were wondering, Line Smoothing Serum retails for $50 by itself. Just a metal tip that has a little it where you can squeeze out product and use it on the go like if you don't want to carry this or if you don't want to buy this you can use this to depuff like if you just want to carry this item by itself or you can use it in conjunction with the line smoothing device to use all of the, her devices you need to use a gel which i have the big size this is the hydrating aqua gel i've heard you can use like ultrasound gel this is a microcurrent activator that you have to use with this product and all the others about this little one it's nice it's compact I do like it and I do see a difference whenever I do use it. One of the best things about it, I think, is that you can charge it. You can literally carry this in your purse and just whip it out anywhere. I tend to wear makeup whenever I'm outside of the house, so I don't carry it on a day-to-day -day basis. But if you are more of a natural girl or traveling a lot, it's compact enough to carry with your makeup essentials. It does hold the charge pretty well, but whenever you first get it, you do need to charge it for a good day just to ensure the uh, longevity of it. Now moving on to this one. This is the mini facial toning device it tools for $209 and the difference between this one and the one I previously shared is that these heads here where the microcurrent is distributed onto your skin are larger so to tone the jawline or accentuate the hollows of your cheeks or your cheekbone here and also you can define more like your temples and if you have anything going on your forehead tighten up a little bit towards your hairline you know I don't have too too many concerns in my forehead area but I will say whenever this does reach your hairline or gets in contact with hair it does feel a little bit funny kind of like a little bit of a shocking sensation while using these devices if you ever do feel like it's pinching you or or maybe it is too strong that's because you're running out of gel or your skin is dry there and you need to have that to activate it otherwise it is going to be shocking you if you put it to your bare skin but same thing with this other one that you do have to charge it a whole day before being able to use it on and off it does have a few different modes of vibration or microcurrent strength you can just start it off like this and then to turn it off just hold the button and it'll power off as you go through the zones it'll beep and then that's your indicator that you have to move on to the next area or start that process again this is not a device where you can just go like this and you'll see it maybe you can do it that way it is most recommended to apply a little bit of pressure on your skin and then just glide it so slightly up until you get that beep the device will turn off by itself after five minutes of use so if you want to time two and a half minutes on this side and then two and a half minutes on that i do have the new face body the new body retails for $399 and it does come with an aqua gel. And before I bought this one, I contemplated because I was saying, well, this is almost this put together. I can use this on my body too, but it's just nicer to have this and cover a bigger portion of your skin, kind of like your stomach to reduce any cellulite or accentuate
it a little bit of the toning. This device is a little bit heavier, but I believe you can probably get away with toning your body with this one, or they do have another device called the Trinity, which is a little bit bigger than the mini version. And that one I don't own because I do have this one. I didn't feel the need to buy that device as well, but I do like this one. And same thing with the line smoothing. You do see instant changes in your face whenever you do use these two devices. So if you are someone who doesn't want to do Botox or you know surgery, I think if you use this on a more regular basis, you would have more permanent results. I try to use these maybe once a week or once every other week, just so it depends. I don't really need too much, but it's also really fun to see the lifting and sculpting of your chin and all of that goodness right after using it. So that is pretty cool with the devices. This, the new body, I will say that I think this one's a little bit cheaper. Like if you look at the top, it just looks like a little sticker that is on there, almost like I can flick it off or flake it off kind of situation. That's the only complaint about this one and it's a little bit heavier because of course it does have more metal, but I do like the new body because it does allow me to cover a larger area of my body much quicker. Now to do your whole body, like if you want to tone the back of your legs or the sides, reduce some of that cellulite, it does take a little bit longer if you're going to use it for your entire body. It's not so much a five minute one and done kind of like it is with these other two devices. You really do have to set aside a good 25 30 minutes to get some targeting you can use this in your arms you can use it in your belly or if you want to contour maybe the sides of your stomach to give you i don't know like an hourglass maybe something like that i primarily just use it like on my belly and on my thighs for any cellulite reduction which like i said these are not permanent results by no means by any of these three devices with a new body i see results the day of and the next day it's nothing that lasts for like an entire week kind of sort of situation, but I don't use this every day It is recommended to use it every day in order to get those long-lasting results But I just kind of use it every now and then or whenever I feel like I have a little bit of a spare time or Just want to use them and this one is much bulkier to travel with So if you are considering one to be able to use everything I would probably be the mini or the Trinity the Trinity does have options of using like a wrinkle light reducer and like an eye lifter so kind of like a this in this put together sort of situation i'll pop some images of that but if you're contemplating on all of the devices it's probably the best one to get out of the range that they have again i don't have the trinity i do have a wider range of their core products to be able to say what i would recommend if you could only buy one um this one is not a must-have again you can probably do the same thing with this it's just going to take you a little bit longer but yeah this is a very cool device and does give you spa like results and you can do it in the comfort of your own home so that's the plus and the best thing about all of these devices is that they do hold a charge so I don't have to have them plugged in and that's one of the cons for some of the other items that I'm going to talk about. Moving on to a device that does do what it says but I don't like to use. It is the PMD which is a personal microdermabrasion device. It comes with a variety of different exfoliating tips and you can buy them for I think $19.99 or $29.99. It'll come with two different attachment heads to match the tips. So one's for your face and one is for your body. And the difference is just the hole at the top. This one's smaller where this one, it allows to cover a larger area. Like if you want to use it in your back or maybe like your leg. So it does come with a little foam, which you put it there and then you put your tip according to if you're going to use it on your face or your body. Um, and then you screw it on. Plug it in and go to town. Right at the end, you do have to clean all the separate pieces to, you know, for hygiene purposes. And then um, also the little sponge. You can see a difference right away. So it'll have suction power and you'll just glide it through and you'll keep going up and up. You should never go over the same area twice or else it will irritate the area or cause like red markings that'll stay there a little bit longer. I find this is best like whenever I have a breakout and it's drying out. You this to remove like the peach fuzz or even out your texture of your skin where you have some unevenness good for exfoliating all around you can't use it on its own right on off on off and the thing is you have to have it plugged in
and it is quite loud it's kind of like using an actual sanding machine every time i have this on my husband's like what are you doing so it's not something you can hide away and do late at night or if you do live alone i mean it doesn't matter right <laughs> the pmd brand did come up with one that you can charge and use it wirelessly like that one actually retails for 299 whereas this one is 100 dollars cheaper it's 199 but you have to have it plugged in all the time so you have to be either in your restroom or somewhere around a plug so like if you're at a hotel and you know your spouse is using the restroom you would either have to share or while you know they take a bath shower whatever the effect that i have to plug this in steers me away from using it more often if you are able to get the more expensive one or catch it on sale get that one because you would probably not use it just like me this is one of my least used items just because i have to plug it in and i use it in my restroom and it's still my least use i mean like the plug is there and it's just when i do see a lot of dullness in my skin i will use it to just kind of freshen up and bring in that new layer of skin is a nice to have but not a must have and i actually got mine on sale i actually got most of these devices on sale so wait for them to be on sale don't buy them full price because i do find that you'll either have a promotion directly from the brand or through ulta sephora nordstrom neiman's whoever carries the devices you'll have promotions here and there you'll never buy them full price unless you really want to it works but it's not the most friendly to use and that is based on personal preference of course so the PMD in the shade pink. Moving on to a device that I don't know why I bought. Um, I did get it on sale, so yay. This is the Dermaflash Mini Precision Fuzz Removal. I got it because, well, you know, for like your mustache area or do some touch-ups around my eyebrows in between waxing. Also to use it in place of this every now and then. As a bonus, it does have a roller at the bottom that you can use to depuff. So my biggest thing with this is one it doesn't come with a cap if you are on the go you literally have to put it in a ziploc bag or make sure you don't have it in any of your expensive cosmetic bags so that it doesn't tear through the other thing is i can actually just say that it's best for you to just go with a tried and true razor that are disposable probably like seven eight bucks for like a pack of three at like target this guy is 69 dollars going over the other things is when i see this device it has two buttons it has one at the front and then it has one at the back this one in the back is to power and this one is to remove the cartridge and um do the refill and as you saw you don't really need to even press the button because it comes off by itself so really and truly they could have just made one whole button for power and then that is it this is battery operated you have to screw off the bottom portion or pull it actually and then it has your battery mine is actually dead and that is another thing it did not hold the charge for like nothing and it's a battery right i felt like the battery should have lasted longer than it actually did for being such a small device something that you use very quickly um my battery should still work and i haven't had this for too too long a lot of people do really like it because it removes your peach fuzz and it allows for an even makeup application which yes is right but as you're using it i find that you still have to put a lot of pressure like it's gonna give you a, again mine is dead but it's gonna give you a vibrating sensation but i find that it doesn't work as well as these risers do so just go with these and ditch this one save your 70 bucks or if you do find it on sale try it that way if you really do want to try it and, and again i did buy it on sale and even then i'm kind of like uh uh yeah no so moving on to something more positive this is the foreo lumina play mini this is a mini handheld device that unlike the one i just spoke about has an internal battery and i've had it for three years and it still works and it still works in full power so this one does have a two different bristle types so it has some that are more compact and some that are separated to give a little bit of a different exfoliation on the skin i use this nearly every day for cleansing my skin it's fun to have that deeper exfoliation or i don't even know if it is going in there deeper but it is fun to use and it does really bubble up my facial cleanser after you use it your face literally feels 
you like to the touch squeaky clean and smooth so i guess if you wanted a cheaper cheaper version of like the pmd this one will do the job just as fine in my opinion it does exfoliate a very so gently because it is silicone bristles they don't sell this version anymore i think whenever i got it it was 49 dollars, and it would go on sale here and there for half off or 30 percent off they do have a luna plate too which i believe is 69 dollars, and it comes with different colors might not have the fuchsia anymore but they do have a array of different devices some that are much larger to cover maybe like your body to exfoliate so this one is literally always in my sink it's so compact and again so stunned by that battery is still going strong it's very easy to also sanitize it does have the play button to activate the device small enough to get like in this little area right here to cleanse around there so i really do like this i haven't tried any of the other foreo larger devices i have tried their toothbrush which their toothbrush is fine too but it's expensive they do have a mini version which i would recommend which is actually the one that i tried but anyways going back to this one if you do want it for just your face i recommend just a small one if you're going to use it for your body then go for the larger ones but the larger ones compared to this one there is like a significant price difference between the larger ones and the small one that they have currently available honestly if you want this like for your chest area or even like for your back or what have you i think this is fine obviously for your back you're not going to be able to cover a large area because between your reach and the actual device but if you do want a larger one maybe you can consider that and also use it for your face just know the the small one does allow you to get into smaller or more crevices compared to a bigger one i really do like this device and i don't think that you need too too many like if you want a mini and another one like this one's good enough for travel and for every day again this one's discontinued but they do have the luna plate too moving on to another derma flash device i totally forgot that this was by the same brand because this one i actually do like compared to this little peach fuzz remover so this device is kind of like a pen and this one you can charge it and use it you know wirelessly so fantastic has two different settings so it has an infuse and an extract this is for like your blackheads or whiteheads so like for your pores of the infuse side pushes in your product there a little bit more or like if you have a very bougie gel cream that you want to feel like it's getting pressed into your skin a little bit more you can use the infuse side i usually just use it for the extract portion you can travel with you don't have to worry about bending or breaking the tip because it does come with a covering so the two settings one is to extract and the other one is to infuse the one for extract you do have to have your skin a little bit wet and then it just it's so easy to use you just glide it through and you can see the pore gunk build up on the metal tip and then another cool thing about this device is that on its own as you are doing it you don't really think it's doing too much but i find like the next day it brings out all these impurities or breakouts to my skin you definitely don't want to use this before an event but to prep a weeks in advance for sure and it does work it also does hold the charge pretty well so um it gets a plus from me it retails for 99 dollars and it comes in different colors i just pick pink because most of my gadgets are already pink and um, I wanted to go ahead and coordinate a little so this is the pore extractor by Dermaflash. Moving on to my last device and this is hair removal machine. This one's actually from Amazon so I don't know the exact brand but it has 600,000 or 6 million different flashes. I've had this one for three years now and it still has the same flashes like I haven't had to remove the cartridge. We do have to use it alongside red glasses to protect your eyes because of that flash being so intense and you also have to have it hooked on at all times as you can imagine i don't use for that purpose if it was more of a wireless kind of handheld device i would have used it a lot more or i would use it more frequently you have to use it between three to four times per week for like a good six weeks and then kind of tone down for maybe two to three times a week and then maybe like once every other week for maintenance purposes because i don't use this two to frequent obviously my hair still grows but whenever i do use it more constantly i see that my hair growth is much thinner and less so it does help and it does work but it takes such a long time so i have it in off my personal device has a setting where you hold the on off button and then it will tell you how many more 
how many more flashes it has and then you can also amp up the intensity the volume right there and then to activate the actual flash you have to press this button it's not gonna flash if it's not hitting contact with skin let's just you see it did have a flash that is how this device works and again you have to have it it says off but the fan is still like cooling down and you can feel it here my actual device has an auto setting if you hold on to the clicks move into auto mode and this i don't like it too much because look You see, the flash on the auto setting is not too rapid enough to be able to help you move and finish quicker. Talking about finishing quicker, it takes me about a good 45 minutes to an hour to be able to do like my whole legs and like my armpit area. You have to allocate time. You do have to shave beforehand to be able to use it and bring the pigment on your skin out so it can detect where the hair grows and sap it, right? So that is how this works. So it's something that you have to have a lot of time to do i most of the time just use it on the single click 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 kind of mode because i feel like that one's a little bit faster than the actual auto mode so the auto mode is probably not as automatic as i would like it to be but again it could just be my device there is an array of different hair removal devices out on the market a big one from a youtube some years ago was by the brand kenzie i believe it was um there's another one or they might have rebranded names it's a much smaller device it's maybe like this size it's so it's more compact honestly i don't find anything wrong with this particular size now if it was smaller you can probably get in like much critical areas if you need to you could probably even travel with it much better than this but quite honestly it does take such a long time even like to cover one leg <laughs> it takes you such a long time to do it i mean if you're traveling are you really gonna set aside to do your legs like i don't know it just doesn't make sense to me which that is why i say that it doesn't matter if it's big or if it's small if you are looking for a hair removal device to use at home again it does work but you have to be consistent with it something that i most definitely am not because it requires time and you have to have it hooked on right and you have to prep too so it's a device that requires from you for it to give you what you need so um not so much convenience but it's nice to have every now and then and again it does work so here is mine and i'm gonna try to link it down below if it's still available if not i'm just gonna um provide like a good alternative i want to say that it was between 150 and 200 dollars and if i can find one that has a wireless option i will put that down below for you i'm gonna demonstrate the line fix by new face so a little bit of the gel because you need that and just a tiny bit because i'm just gonna do it on my lips just to kind of show a before and after i'm only gonna use it on one side so you can see the dramatic results that it does um, provide instantaneously. So I'm going to use it on this side. So this is just gel and nothing before. Okay, now let's start the device. It's very quiet. So pretty cool instant lift of results with any of the new face products. I did want to share very quickly where it is that I store my items. So I have a deluxe beauty box, which I don't think they are in business anymore. This is where I have all of my stuff. So I have a drawer for my laser hair removal, all the stuff that it requires or that I need for that device. And then my PMD, the charger for that, we're well, not the charger, the actual power because you do have to use it in conjunction. And then I have my 
extra tips as well as my other device and then i have this one on there too with the corresponding chargers and then i have a whole nother one for my new face devices my actual body one doesn't fit it like if you can see this clearance right here it, it won't close so i just have this at the very top of my box and then um that's pretty much how i store all of my devices so pretty handy compact in one area i personally love my luna play and then also the, the mini by new face i feel because these are compact and also they're ready like i can pick it up like on demand because they are wireless you can just pick it up and use it as long as you have gel, at least for this one in particular. So a little bit of a con, you do have to have this. These are the ones that definitely get the most use out of all of them. And then out of everything, stay away from the Dermaflash peach remover, at least in my experience. It's just better to go with the little cheaper ones. And then these other devices are kind of just up to what it is that you're looking for. Like you might not need a pore extractor, you might not need an exfoliator, and you might not need a laser hair removal machine, or a body toning device it just so depends what it is that you are looking for and you need in your collection of course there is some items that i do have in my wish list which i'll pop a few here on the screen and let me know if you have those and uh, what your experience is with them so far hopefully my little quick wrap-up video was able to help you identify whether it is that you want something or you can steer clear from it or buy an alternative again i'm going to try to link all of these items down below if you have any questions let me know what those are and i hope that you'll decide to subscribe if you're not already a part of my channel and thank you so much for spending a little bit of your day with me goodbye